Hey, boys. Yeah. What? Guess what I got? What? Look. Well, wow, look at what we got here. We've got brown boxes to me. I wonder what's inside these boxes. What is that? Hey, let's move this out of the way and let's have a little look, see, shall we? What does that look like? That. It's a laptop battery. I wonder how many boxes we've got here. Let's count them. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight, nine, ten, seven, eight, eight, nine, twenty, twenty-one, twenty-two. Twenty-two boxes of laptop batteries. Should we uh arrange them? Okay. Or do you want to still pull up your flies? Uh, <laughs> <laughs> okay. We've um, gone through all those boxes, unboxed all of it. We didn't do an unboxing video because unboxing 24 boxes of laptop batteries I think would have been a little bit boring. But for those die-hard enthusiasts who like unboxing, uh, stick to the end. We've got something special for you. But having now put the batteries out behind me, and then you can see some of it, it looks mammoth. It's a mammoth task. Open these up, take the cells out, test them and so on. I think we've bitten more than we can chew. But I think we'll chew through it. It's going to be quite interesting. So let me just quickly show you what we got and then uh, we'll just take it from there. Scary. How many we got? There is a fair few batteries. They vary. Most of them are Dell pack. Most of them will be dead laptop cell batteries. Very, very few of them are these yucky lithium polymer batteries. Um, so that's, that's all that was there. Quite a bit managed to get at a very good price. It's going to let you absorb that for a moment. quality ones. The Dell um, mainly I've got two types here. There's the F287H and I've also got more of the J1 KNDs. 11.4 volts nominal and 11.4 volts as well. That would be six cells in a pack. One could be dead, two could be dead, who knows. Now we've also got a few assorted ones here as well. Now these ones here in boxes I was told some of these could be good, some of these could be bad, we don't know, but they've been included for free just for me to check as well. All right, let's talk about the total. Here we go, I've got my two nerdlings here. Hello guys. Hi. Um, what we want to know is the total. Uh, I think you've got it written down there, haven't you? So do you want to go through the top? J1K and D, the total of that is 794. 794 of the J1K and Ds, okay. Okay, the next one is KM742, they are yeah. 118. 118 of that, okay. And the F287M have 94 in total. They're all three. Three of those are Dell batteries. Okay, next. Okay, assorted are 114. Okay, so they could be Lenovo, they could be all sorts. What's the total? 1120. 1120. That's incredible. So if we assume that we've got six cells in a pack, we can assume that. Uh, even the ones that are odd, there'll be nine in some packs and be three in some packs so we're just gonna assume that there's six cells on average there as well what is the total six thousand seven hundred and twenty six thousand seven wow six thousand seven hundred and twenty cells here of the 18650s and if we say ten percent is wasted let's keep the math simple for myself because i'm not clever like these two that's six thousand cells so six thousand what was it six thousand yeah six thousand 6,700, no. And 20. And 20. So if we say 6,000 is the good cells that we're going to get out of it, 10% is wastage. We're going to try and achieve 2,000 milliamp hours, 2 amp hours out of each cell that are good of the 6,000. So we potentially could get 6,000 times 2, which is 12. Thousand amp hours or 12 kilo kilo amp hours yeah yeah kilo amp hours and we don't know what we're going to do with that quantity we just want to break them up uh, test them for their capacity but if you've got any suggestions why don't you comment below what you think I should do with them and then we can maybe give it some consideration thank you for watching oh yeah thank you for watching and don't forget to subscribe keep watching this space and let's see how this evolves thank you very much